Hello class! Welcome to today's daily reading review. My name is Mrs. Lawson and I am so very glad that you're here. This week we are going to be reviewing the two vowel rule. Hmm, if we have a word with one syllable and there are two vowels, usually the first vowel says its name and the second one is silent. And that is what we're going to be reviewing. Before we do though, we are going to look at some words that we learned last week. Can you read this one? This one has two vowels. And the first one is going to say its name and the next one is silent. Your. <gasps> this one follows that same pattern. Use. This follows the one vowel rule. Can. This one, hmm, this one we're going to remember. The S and the D make the sounds that we're used to. S, ed, said. Hmm. We need to remember that the A and the I make the E eh sound. Said. And then your. Let's go over all of these again. Use, can, said, and your. Good remembering. Did you remember all of those from last week? I hope that you are reviewing your words. Well, we have some new words that we're reviewing this week. Let's say them together. And I know you can read this one because you can read all the sounds. What is it? If do, all, were, how, and one more. One. Let's try those again. If, do, all, were, one, and I think I did two at a time. How. Good job. I'm going to put all of those words up on the screen. And I want you to point to the word if. If. Did you point right up there? Good job. What about the word how? How. It's right down there. Good job. And what about the word were? There it is. There's just one word left, and it's right up there. Can you read it? It's the word all. Well done. Well, class. Before we go into the classroom, I want to take you back to the ice caves for you to practice some of the words that we have already learned. Come on to a family adventure with me. The, of, and, a, to, in, is, you, that, it, he was for on are as with his they I at B this have from All right class, let's jump right in and take a look at this word. The first thing that I want you to notice are the vowels. How many vowels are there? 
Did you yell out two? There are two vowels. Hmm. When there are two vowels walking together, the first one does the talking. Have you heard that before? When two vowels go walking, the first one does the talking. This is because our first vowel is going to say its name and the next one is going to be silent. E t eat. Did you already know that? I bet that you did. Well, we are going to add the H. What does the H say? <sighs> Eat. Heat. Good reading. What if I put a B? <gasps> Did you yell out beat? Well done. What about the letter N? N E T. Neat. Good job. And can you tell that I'm going to put the letter S next? Now, for those of you who know it, yell it out. <gasps> Good reading. Help me read it with everyone else. S e t seat. There are two vowels. The first one is going to do the talking. S e t. Excellent reading. Now, I am going to swap out the a for an E. Hmm. Look at this word. How many vowels do you see? Two. When two vowels go walking, the first one does the talking. F e t feet. Good job. We are going to swap out the F for a G and an R. I want you to say the sounds with me. G, r, e, t. G, r, e, t. What's the word? Greet. Excellent reading. We are going to try one more. Do you know what that says? I want you to say the sounds with me. R e t s t r e t. Hmm. I can say the sounds all one at a time, like s s t r. Or I could start with one and just keep going. S t r e t. What's the word? Street. Good reading. All right, class, let's take a look at this sentence. Hmm, there are some words in here that are similar to each other. The first one is one of our new words. D-O says do. Hmm, the D says d. And the O represents the sound oo. Hmm, that's not normal for one O. Usually there are two O's to make this oo sound. But there's another word in our sentence that does the same thing. Two. The T says t and the O makes the oo sound. Do and two. So I want you to remember those two words. Let's read this together. Do you like to eat? Eat. P ease. Peas. Let's back up and start over again and read that super smoothly. Do you like to eat peas and b beans? Beans. The word eat. Peas and beans all have two vowels in them. They're walking together. The E says its name and the next is silent. The E says its name and the A is silent. The E says its name and the A is silent. Please read this together with me. Do you like to eat peas?
peas and beans. Do you? It's very good for you to eat your vegetables. You'll notice that my sentence ends with a question mark because it's a question. Oh dear, but what's wrong up here? It needs a capital letter. I knew that you would notice. Well class, thank you so very much for reading with me today. I hope that you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.